Hello everyone and welcome back to another NapTech tutorial. In this video I'll be showing you how to get this screensaver clock wallpaper kind of thing on your Mac, PC, iPhone or iPad. It is quick, easy and completely free and I'll show you how to do it on all these devices. So even if you have a PC, uh, Acer, Dell, HP, whatever, stay tuned. I'll show you how to do that on these devices as well as Mac, MacBook Pros, MacBook Airs or iMac. All right, so before we start, I just want to let you know that this is uh, the best way to do it. I'm sure there are other alternatives. Um, this is completely free, quick, and easy, so I thought I'd show you this method. Um, it's also the one that's being used on Instagram a lot. I'm seeing it on tech blogs and, and different um, tech channels um, that, that use this, so let's get right into it. The first thing you're going to want to do is go to the link in the description below. It'll take you to this Flicklo site, which is the name of the extension or um, sort of program we'll be using. It's a very quick light download so you'll click here in the three bars um, and it'll take you to screensaver. Now if you are doing this on Mac or PC Windows uh, click here and follow these steps. If you want to do this on your iPhone or iPad stick to the end because I'll show you how to do that as well. So scroll down and as you can see we have two different downloads one for Mac one for Windows. Choose the one that that's for your uh, computer and click on download. It is completely free as you can see both versions uh, make sure to allow the download. All right, once it's downloaded, whether you're on PC or Mac, open the file that was downloaded. On Mac, it will be a .dmg. On Windows, it'll probably be a .exe. Um, make sure you have Adobe Flash for Windows. Okay, so here we are in Mac. Um, as you can see, we get this sort of uh, drive and it has the saver, which we'll be using, a readme file that you can ignore and a donate with PayPal. Now, if you are want to support uh, the developer you can donate here, but the only file we're interested in right now is this one, flicklo.savior. So double click this file and it will take you to your system preferences, which is where you set up your screensavers anyway. Um, and as you can see, it tells us um, the flicklo screensaver must be installed before you can use it. Do you want to install it now? You want to install it for um, your user only if you only want one user to have access to the screensaver. If you want all of the users on your computer to be able to activate this screensaver, click on the second option here. I'll just be doing the first one for this video and click on install. Give it a second. There is no loading bar sort of thing. It'll just take you into the screensaver settings once it's done. And as you can see, it's right here. So to activate it, click on it here. You can edit its options. Um, these are nice and handy. You can change uh, the type of uh, format for the time. Let's go with 12 hour, change the scale if you want to make it a bit bigger, uh, fill the, the whole screen or you know half the screen. Uh, change up the brightness as well. Uh, and so I hide the background, but it doesn't matter. Um, and click on OK. Now it is completely activated. There's no save button or anything like that. Make sure to deactivate show with clock because it is, because it is awkward. Um, I'll show you right now. It is awkward to have uh, a clock on top of a clock, you know? So make sure to turn this off and there we go. That's pretty much it for Mac. For Windows, it's the same. Uh, make sure to launch the file uh, and install it on your Windows PC. Um, if you are on a mobile device, iPad or iPhone, I'll show you how to do that quickly. Go to mobile app, uh, make sure to open the link obviously on your device, so on your iPhone or iPad. Scroll down and whoop, click on download the app store. Uh, it is paid for uh, mobile devices, but um, it's a one-time payment. Uh, just to download the app. So you'll download it on the App Store and just open the app and you'll have it there. And that's pretty much it. Um, I think it's a really cool feature, especially, um, you know, compared to the other standard screensavers that come with the computer. Um, let me show you them quickly here. So it's pretty much just pictures and, and different types of animations. Uh, I really like it. Um, as you can see, it's been featured on Instagram a lot. It's sleek, it's modern. So that's how you get it completely free. All right, if this video helped you out, make sure to hit that like button. Um, also, subscribe if you want more how-to quick videos like this. Um, and yeah, let us know in the comment section below if you have any questions or if you have any other video suggestions. See you in the next one.